I was the last one to get in the band that became the Allman Brothers. And uh, <clears throat> I don't know what my brother told those people before I got there, you know. Like, wait, yeah, wait till he gets here, man. He'll write us some hits. We're gone. <laughs> but I got there. I had 22 songs when I arrived. And uh, came the day of me on the hot seat with a guitar. And the rest of them around here. I don't think we'd even named the band yet. And uh, they said, uh, let's, let's see what you got. And I'm going, whoa. And uh, I play him one, and yeah, I like, <laughs> what else you got, man? Uh, <laughs> and I'd play him another one, and okay, what else you got? <laughs> So uh, I put Dreams on them, this song called Dreams. Man, if ever in my life I belonged, it was then. We had all our stuff set up. I played it for them. Well, I played it for them on a Hammond. And uh, that's the only song I've ever, ever written on a Hammond. Uh, and uh, everybody got up, got on the instrument. We learned it, and it's we learned it, and it's played the same way today. Man, I was part of that band, and that is such a good feeling that within the, in, within the next nine days, I wrote the whole first album, Whipping Post and uh, Black Hearted Woman, and a whole bunch of them. So. Like I said, when you write when you write a new song, it's uh, wow, it is an incredible feeling, especially if it's one that that impresses your peers. What's up? This is Monkey from Corn. It's El King. Mark Hoppus. Tinge Glumon. Tori Kelly. We're Lucas Graham. I'm Chris from Motionless and White. What's up? This is Problem. I'm Lindsay Sterling, and make sure to subscribe so that you can see more videos from incredible artists.